The math is all there. It's not real. Yes, it is. Yeah, but look, it is scientifically impossible for a person to tip a cow. <laughs> Even you, with your stocky build and lumberjack shoulders, you couldn't do it. It's horrible. Why would you push a cow over this sacred? Oh, stop it. I've seen you eat like a million hamburgers. Hey, an animal can be both sacred and delicious. <laughs> I'm telling you I've done it, okay? I clearly remember the cow standing up and then the cow on its side. Were you drunk? I was 16 in Nebraska. What do you think? I think you're the one who fell over. Well, that would explain why the sky was also on its side. Hey. Howard, cow tipping, real or not? I'm gonna say not. That's just based on me trying to roll my mom over when she's snoring. <laughs> Speaking of that big side of beef, uh, she's invited all of you to Thanksgiving at her house. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, I've been told that a bald refusal of an invitation is rude, and one must instead offer up a polite excuse, so I'd love to go, but unfortunately, that sounds awful. Come on, it'll be fun. Uh, we were actually gonna do it here. Please, Bernadette's bringing her dad because her mom's out of town. I never have anything to say to that guy. Oh, since you put it that way, yeah, I'd love to go, but that sounds even more awful. <laughs> would actually be nice to not hear Sheldon complain about my cooking all day. Yo, excuse me, but every year you prepare a terrible meal and every year I criticize it. Do our traditions mean nothing to you? <laughs> I want to go. Yeah, me too. I'm in. Sheldon. Oh, fine, I'll go. But if her food is delicious, Thanksgiving is ruined, and it's on you. <laughs> do we really have to go to Mrs. Wallowitz's house? We do, and I expect you to be on your best behavior. Now I know how the African slaves felt. <laughs> Being dragged from their homes to labor under the yoke of the white man. <laughs> Are you honestly comparing Thanksgiving dinner at Wallowitz's mom's with one of the greatest tragedies in the history of mankind? Yes. <laughs> Sheldon, you can have a nice Thanksgiving anywhere. I spent one in Vegas. You did? Yeah, back when I was dating Zach. It was actually more fun than I thought. We gambled, went to one of those cheesy wedding chapels. We had a really good turkey dinner, which was surprising since we were at a strip club. <laughs> Wait, you went to a chapel? Yeah. Why? We had one of those silly fake weddings. <laughs> Penny, you know those are real, right? No, they're not. <laughs> yeah, they are. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. And he's right. They're real. But it didn't seem real. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. At any point, was Las Vegas on its side? <laughs> I'll get the door Well, you finish laughing. <laughs> hey, guys. Happy Thanksgiving. It smells wonderful. Is anyone slaving away in the kitchen? Because I do know what you... <laughs> Here, thank you for having us. What's with you? Oh, she's mad at me because she just found out she's married to Zach. Really? That dumbass you used to date? That's hysterical. I can't believe I felt bad for opening this in the car. <laughs> hey, I found the uh, court papers that you and Zach need to fill out. I'll print them when we get home. Fine. And we can just put this whole thing behind us. Are you done? What? Look, I get it. I screwed up. Is this all we're going to talk about the rest of the day? Why are you mad at me? You're the one that did this stupid thing. I'm just trying to fix it. Oh, I need some air. Well, Penny. I don't know the first thing about women, but I would not follow her. <laughs> Listen to Stretch.